So let's kind of jump into the Logan Paul versus Floyd Mayweather fight. Logan Paul, who is a famous YouTube vlogger, will be fighting retired uh, boxing legend um, Floyd Mayweather. Uh, the fight is scheduled for February 20th of next year. Um, the fight has kind of been in the works for a while. Uh, a lot of back and forth, trash talk on Twitter, the usual stuff that keeps fights from actually being scheduled. I believe Logan was the one who initiated the idea because he was so eager to continue his uh, momentum after the exposure he got from fighting YouTuber KSI. The fight, I think, was confirmed to happen after what his brother did. Jake Paul, Logan's brother, he fought Nate Robinson, a former NBA player, for one of the preliminary matches for the uh, Mike Tyson fight. And that fight caused a big commotion on Twitter because Jake Paul knocked out Nate Robinson and caused a lot of memes and just, you know, built a huge following. And that's when it clicked to Floyd. He's like, man, these dumbass Paul brothers generate a lot of views and money. I love money. And that, that right there said, all right, make this happen. Uh, it pretty much sped up the process and got the fight scheduled. This fight is just for entertainment. Let's be very serious. Floyd just loves money and Logan just loves exposure. Lo Logan isn't scared to um, fight Floyd because he knows he's going to get paid along with that exposure. The same thing happened with Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor was an MMA fighter who challenged Floyd um, on the ring and Conor knew if he won or lost, he was going to get the biggest payday of his life. And he did. Um, this, w this fight is just a win-win scenario for both fighters. It's more of a win scenario for Logan. He gets the exposure and the money. Um, there's a reason why Floyd is 50-0. He never picks a fight where he's not 100% sure he can't win. Um, every matchup is carefully calculated and selected by his team. Because his team does all the analytics, all the numbers, and make sure that F Floyd is going to get that money. I mean, it's been speculated years ago that they delayed the Manny Pacquiao fight because they were waiting for him to get old and have a he would and just not be at his peak anymore. I mean, at the time he was fighting with like a shoulder injury, so that's why the fight was kind of disappointing. It just wasn't a full-on brawl. I mean, I have no confirmation this is how they do it, but it's just very speculated because he doesn't really, um, he does, it's, he's never really had a close loss, I don't think. This will not end in a knockout. Um, if so, it'll be something like a technical knockout like what happened with Connor. Floyd is just not a knockout artist. He plays the waiting and scorecard game. Um, let's say that Logan is prepared, he's in great shape, and has the power to knock out a professional boxer like Floyd. Either way, Floyd knows the sport so well that he uses his great vision and evasive techniques to be probably one of the best defensive fighters that we've ever seen. And, and the rules help him out, too, since he knows the rules so well, way, way more than Logan does. And, of course, Floyd's going to do his thing where he runs around and waits for the fighter to get you know agitated or steamed out, and he'll capitalize on the advantage point that will make him win the, a round or the fight in general. I'm pretty sure... Both guys are in completely different weight classes. I'm going to assume um, Logan is heavier than Floyd. I'm curious if he's going to lose weight or is Floyd going to gain weight and they're going to meet halfway. I don't know. I mean, either way, we can't really take it seriously as an actual, as an actual fight. Um, don't overthink this fight. It's simply a professional boxer fighting a YouTube vlogger that boxes on the side. I mean, <laughs> just the headline itself is very controversial and grabs a lot of people's attention. It's a famous YouTuber people don't like because he's controversial, fighting a boxer that's undefeated and who's very cocky and loves to flash his money. Either way, somebody's going to come out of this happy uh, if you're an audience. You get to see Floyd finally get knocked out. You know, finally get to see Logan Paul get shut up in the rain. I mean, am I going to watch the fight? Oh, hell yeah, I'm going to watch this fight. I mean, it's something I've never seen before in boxing. And I grew up watching boxing. Um with my family, my parents to be exact, because um, they always go to boxing parties with their friends, and it'd be nice to have a lot of food and just, you know, just hang out and watch boxing. It's, so it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'll watch this fight, and depending how it goes, I might even do a post-fight review. So we'll see what happens with that.